Hmm, Aditya, this shoots very good video. I think we should do a video story first, then tell us. Hello everyone, welcome back to Pixel Village and I am Radha Krishnan. Well, COVID-19 is still around and it's not really showing any intention to leave us anytime soon. Many households are, you know, they are all working from home. They are shopping from home. Children are getting schooled in a virtual school. And, uh, well, the internet has almost become the oxygen and uh, computers and mobile devices have become the weapon of choice. Well, I thought at this juncture, it's only appropriate that we talk more about mobile devices. So we have an interesting product, which I think will enable you to connect with the world better, interact with the world better, because that's the way you are interacting with the world now, majorly. So we're going to talk about an interesting product. I have the device here we have unboxed it in fact this came a week and a half back with us and I've been using it ever since this device was announced during the beginning of this year uh, but eventually it came into market only about month month and a half back and definitely as you know we are not going to worry about what processor it has or what screen resolution it has and things like that we're going to worry only about you know what the camera. Now this phone has two rear cameras, one wide angle and one standard, the main camera which is only 12 megapixel and the front facing camera is 32 megapixel. Now please don't worry about resolutions at all when it comes to a mobile phone. Just make sure that it takes good images and 12 megapixels are good enough for almost all purposes in the internet world, in the mobile world, okay? So please don't worry if you don't have a phone which is not, you know, 48 and 108 megapixels and all that. If you have it, it's all right. If you don't have it, it's still absolutely all right, okay? Now, how does this become special? It becomes special because of a device that comes along with it. It basically is a cover, but it is not a mobile phone cover. It doubles up as a dual screen, okay? Now, this comes separately. This is made in Korea, this is made in India. Both come in one box. Whenever you want to use a dual screen phone, take your phone, slide it into this case. It fits in perfectly, it clicks in, in place and you get a very positive sound. And uh, now it is, Still single screen, there's a software switch here. Activate it and voila, you have dual screen. Now, there are many ways in which you can configure the second screen. Second screen is called the dual screen, all right? You can use it for multitasking, which means both screens can have independent applications running, or you can split the same application between two screens. Now. It's got a very good screen. That's something which I really like. It's very neutral and there are lots of ways in which you can actually calibrate the screen. Of course, these are pre-calibrated settings. So you pick the one of your choice and you are ready to use it in it. And there are a whole host of, I've not really seen so many options in any other mobile phones. And the color reproduction too, is very nice, very clean and very neutral. Uh, well, I, I personally, as a photographer, I really like unexaggerated, neutral representation of color. So in that way, this is, uh, you know, this is, this is a very good uh, screen. Because it's a folding phone, uh, you know, holding it up is very easy. You can hold it up like this, okay, and use the 32 megapixel front facing camera to record your video. And you can keep your talking points, your notes in the second screen. By doing that, you can actually avoid frequently stopping 
in between the shoot to refer to your notes. I know that there are softwares which will allow you, uh, they are like the teleprompters which will allow you to also look at your notes while, uh, you know, vlogging. But the disadvantage there is you are using the camera app which is provided by the teleprompter software guys which are usually I've found them not as good as the original camera app. So here you can use the original camera app but also keep an eye on your notes. That's a big advantage. Okay, we are ready to vlog. Before that, let me tell you, when I speak into the main camera, you will be hearing the audio coming out of this wireless mic. And when I vlog, the audio will be recorded in the phone itself. Now, let's set the camera. All right, go into the camera app, switch on the camera, go to the video mode. Remember, LG offers uh, steady shots, that is stabilized shots, both with the front camera and the rear camera, both in 4K. All right. So remember to switch that function on. Okay. So now I am trying to vlog with the front facing camera, 4K with the steady uh, shot activated. Uh, by no means, it's a replacement for a gimbal. Okay. Uh, but this makes sure that uh, your uh, shots are relatively stabilized. Uh, now, what you must also remember while doing these kind of shots is that you should not make these kind of jerky movements. You know, if you do that, you can actually see the edges warping, you know, trying to digitally stabilize those, uh, you know, video. Another thing that you can do with the second screen is that when you're shooting very low angle shots uh, and video, you can't really frame it properly, right? Because you can't really go down to that level and uh, frame and also move. If you get into a situation like that, what you can do is uh, switch on the rear camera, of course. And within the camera app itself, you can activate the dual screen mode, which means the camera will be visible in both screens. So you can see exactly what you're shooting when you are doing a very low down shot. So let me do a kind of a low tracking shot okay which otherwise is impossible you can't really see how the frame is looking like here i can actually see the frame and shoot okay we're back in the studio we're going to try and do uh, uh, content creation using the lg g8x uh, thank you and uh, also live streaming using the same phone the setup is very simple. I have the Digitech uh, ring light in front of me. I have a Sirui selfie stick on which I have held the tripod up conveniently. And when I roll both in live streaming and also digital content creation, I can use the second screen to keep all my notes. Now, very interesting feature that I have not seen in many phones. In fact, I have not seen it in any other phone is the fact that uh, this has an audio feature called the ASMR, the Audio Sensory Meridian Response. Let me show you how it works. Uh, when you activate that here, all right, when you whisper into the screen, it actually records it in a very different way altogether. I don't know the dynamics of how it works, but it is very soothing. You can see how crisp and clear the video is and also the audio, okay? The audio, the ASMR is so crisp and clear that you can probably hear everything that is going on in my studio, especially when I start whispering into you. And they say, when you listen to the whisper, it kind of gives you a very soothing feel. In the YouTube world, if you refer, what ASMR is, you will stumble upon tons of videos which will tell you how relaxing listening to ASMR audio is. Let me show you how it works very well. Now, let me move it around. 
ASMR. Well, this is not just meant for, you know, ASMR kind of related kind of videos. It's currently we are recording with regular audio, no ASMR. Um, this kind of setup is perfect for people, uh, you know, creating content tuitions, you know, online tuitions, um, finance related uh, content like equity, stock advice, etc., uh, cookery, travel, you name it. This is brilliant. It's only limited by your imagination. Okay, so now I'm going to live stream using Facebook. Okay, let me uh, take the Facebook first. And there it is. That's my Facebook. Uh, I'm going to go live straight away. And uh, that's my screen. Uh, I don't want to go actually live live. I'm going to currently restrict it only to me. There I am. Okay. There I go. Okay, starting the live video. Hello everyone, welcome back to Pixel Village and I'm Radha Krishnan. Today I'm going live using uh, a special mobile phone, a dual screen one. It's called the LG G8X Think. A long name, but it's a beautiful phone with dual screen. When I'm talking to you, I am looking at some points that I want to talk to you about. Very interesting. Now, if you are a streamer who use uh, mirrorless cameras to stream, well, your dual screen phone can be a perfect monitor for you. Now, here in this case, well, of course, my professional streaming setup is here. I'm using the Fuji X-T3 to stream. I'm using a professional streaming platform. Uh, well, my light is here and I'm ready to stream. Now, when I go live, what happens is the entire set of comments start coming, getting filled up on my screen itself. It's a small screen. Now, how do I know how well it is streaming on the real platform? You are always guessing, right? Usually we don't stream uh, in more than two platforms. At least I don't. My favorites are Facebook and YouTube. So both are opened independently and I can see exactly how it's going on there and if there is a streaming issue, which can happen, you know how it is. When I initially heard about a dual screen, um, you know, mobile phone, I thought it was pure gimmick and, you know, people are running out of uh, ideas to sell a new phone to the customer. And this I thought was uh, a marketing gimmick. But when I started using it, I realized how useful it is and how practical it is uh, to have a dual screen uh, phone, especially to a content creator. Well, uh, equipped with such fine cameras and high quality displays, I think this has taken that game a notch up. This one is not only for those content creators, but also for all those influencers who use uh, mobile platforms to you know, reach to their audience. You can have all your platforms open simultaneously to kind of interact with your audience. I know I have not forgotten the photography capability of this phone, okay? So we will do that in the next video. We will talk about photography and only photography. All right, we see you in the next video. Stay safe. Bye for now.